What's going on guys? It's your boy EJ here with Stay Lady Zero 420 and in this video guys I'm gonna be talking about um my my medical card that I got in the mail today. I made a video about two weeks ago the how to uh how to process and how to get your medical card as well for those that's uh states that's legalized or recreational but recreational you don't need a medical card but for those states that's medical but i do want to show you what it comes with inside when you get it in the mail so let's get to it but what's uh, i do want to talk about if you guys are new to my channel I just want to say welcome what this channel is mainly going to consist of is usually in the 420 space so either if you guys are into 420 and just want to know more about it hit that like and subscribe button right now and comment down below if you have any more if, if you have any questions at all because i do answer them right away and also subscribe if you guys haven't already because i am doing my first ever giveaway to two subscribers once we hit 50 subscribers so watch out for that so but let's get to it all right guys so Right here is the letter that you guys are going to be receiving in the mail once you guys uh, receive it within two, two and a half weeks. That's how long usually I got mines in. So as you guys can see right there, it's the Department of Health. So let's open it up. I already opened it up earlier. And yeah, they want to show my address. And there's the, my, I don't want to show the card yet as well. But right here in the front page, guys, is going to be talking about, um, what does it talk about? <laughs> Uh, just basically talks about uh, if you guys lose it or uh, you guys need to renew it, the process and how much it is and what you guys, if you guys have any um, questions, there's their number right there. And also, you still got to obey the laws as well. But let's go turn to the back. Okay, so here's the registration card in the back. And the, actually, this is the back in the front. It usually has your registration number and when it's expired. So always keep your medical card in hand with your state ID or license, I must say, with you at all times. So let's get to it. I thought it was going to come in like a debit card or, or like a thicker card, but it's usually just like a paper card, kind of like a thin plastic paper. But second page, um, this paper is going to be talking about when you guys grow plants at you guys home, what you guys are supposed to do. So basically write down your registration number right there you guys can see and the expiration date on your on your medical card and ha have it in a clear plastic so if it rains and whatnot and basically just tie it up or have it in front of your plant because if you guys don't have that registration number and your expiration and your uh, the date and whatnot uh, the law enforcement it will basically would has the right to take your plants away so always read this or just keep this in hand when you guys have plants as well in the back as well guys as you guys can see says be a good neighbor and uh, eight tips for medical cannab cannabis use in hawaii i'm pretty sure it's the same laws in other states as well so first one use with caution um you, you watch out if you guys are allergic or you have have a uh, reaction when you guys take medical marijuana into your system don't drive because some people can really drive just like drinking but um, there's just some strains that you guys just gotta watch out for because you guys might be um, what do you guys call it not used to it and three beware of addiction you might get addicted especially if you guys smoke blunts with it as well wraps because the tobacco leaf as well is also addic addictive Four, no public use. As you guys can see, no no smoking on the road, work, school, park, public grounds, and hiking trails and whatnot. Um, five, prevent accidental misuse. Uh, just watch out for that because kids can also get it from you as well. And, you know, it's also accidental misuse if you guys uh, accidentally misuse it. Six, secure your plants. Always keep them uh, in a secure place don't make it visible to your neighbors because they might think the wrong way seven safe travels always uh have a container with your medical card and your state license or identification card and last eight obey all hawaii no smoking laws just like other states i'm pretty sure it's the same laws that uh you know no smoking public areas or within a couple feet with 
away from the buildings and be mindful to others to never use medical cannabis in a manner that may endanger the health or well-being of another. Secondhand smoke is harmful as well. Never smoke near infants, children, or pregnant women. So guys, don't smoke if you guys are either one of those. But yeah, basically that's the car right there. <laughs> Sorry guys, I just had to walk in my wall. But that's it guys. That's the medical marijuana card. If you guys didn't watch the other video, how to get it, um, the process and how to get it, click on my channel right now. Hit the subscribe button. Look for that video. It's about like three videos away from this video. And also check the link down in the description, guys. I do have um, coupons for 420 stuff or just infos and, you know, Uber and Lyft. If you guys need that coupon, I do have it down below. Download it now. Use it later. You never know when you're going to need it. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. EJ here with Stay Lady 0420. Peacing out. But one more thing, guys. If you guys haven't added my our Instagram, I did provide a link down in the description. I do update, I post like three or six pictures a day or videos a day on that Instagram. So I'm more active on there. So add, follow me there. Uh, turn on your post notifications because you never know if you guys might win within my contest once I hit 50 subscribers. But I'm going to stop talking from here, guys. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.